of it is not haram and if it has to happen then it's not something that uh, is necessarily sinful we should avoid of it is not haram and if it has to happen then it's not something that uh, is necessarily sinful we should avoid of it is not haram and if it has to happen then it's not something that uh, is necessarily sinful we should avoid can i shake hands with somebody of the opposite gender My position on this is that it should be avoided as much as possible, but in and of itself, it is not haram. And if it has to happen, then it's not something that uh, is necessarily sinful. We should avoid it. And the protocol should be that the opposite genders are not physically touching one another. Uh, but I think that it is makru, it is best to avoid, but it is not sinful to do so, especially when circumstances are forced on us, such as a job interview or something of this nature. There are many ulama who say that it is haram, and I respect that position. And if you follow that position that is fine as well of course there are hadith that mention that uh, it is better to be pricked in the you know uh, head with the needle than to touch a woman or something some ulama have said these hadith are weak even if it is authentic one can also understand these a hadith to mean when you touch them out of lust. It is authentically narrated that some of the Sahaba, uh, they had um, aunts or whatnot who are not necessarily mahram uh, or elderly family members who are not mahram who would service them, comb their hair, uh, something of this nature. And there are evidences to suggest that uh, some of the Sahaba, uh, it is authentically narrated, uh, would be physically touching and there's no scenario or situation of lust. So the main thing is that lust should not be there um, and it should be avoided as much as possible uh, uh, but as I said, in my, in, in my opinion, it is something that is makru, uh, which means it should be avoided, but it is not haram. هل يجوز مصافحة المرأة الأجنبية التي تأتي من أجل أن تسلم وإذا لم تصافح يحدث فعل عكسي وتظن أنها محتقرة فماذا يفعل المسلم حينئذ؟ الجواب لا يجوز مصافحتها لما روى الترمذي في جامعه عن أمامة عن أميمة بنت رقيقة قالت قال رسول الله صلى الله عليه وعلى اله وسلم اني لا اصافح النساء ولما روى البخاري في صحيحه عن عائشه رضي الله عنها قالت قال رسول قالت في رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم والله ما مست يده يد امرأة قط وروى الطبراني في معجمه عن معك بن يسار رضي الله عنه قال قال رسول الله صلى الله عليه وعلى اله وسلم لأن يطعن أحدكم بمخلط من حديد في رأسه خير له من أن يمس امرأة لا تحل له فتفهم أن هذا ليس من باب الاحتقار ولكنه أمر ديني ثم بعد هذا أيضا مع المصافحة نظر وكلام فلابد من البناء نعم على أساس صحيح وذكرت أن في حديث أميمة بنت الرقيقة أن امرأة قالت ألا تصافحنا يا رسول الله كما تصافح الرجال فقال إني لا أصافح النساء ما قولي 
لمئة امراه الا كقول لامراه وكان النبي صلى الله عليه وسلم يقرأ عليهن الآية التي في آخر الممتحنة ثم يقول لهن أنتن على ذلك فيقولن نعم